Welcome back to JS Urban Adventures. My name is Josh. Today, I'm gonna be reviewing the Columbia Convert snow pants. Waterproof snow pants. Yeah, baby, roll the intro. And we're going sledding. Perfect. Utah in the winter. February. All right, guys. Thanks for coming back to the channel. If you're new here, this is JS Urban Adventures. I do outdoor gear reviews, nomad lifestyle videos, homeless lifestyle videos, urban exploration, wilderness exploration. If you like any of that stuff, subscribe to the channel. Hit the little bell button. Today, like I said in the intro, I'm gonna, be record I'm gonna be reviewing these Columbia Convert snow pants. If you saw a couple videos ago, I did Let's Go Camping in the Snow, and I said I don't have any snow pants, and I was really cold, and my pants were getting wet, and it sucked. Then I did an interview with my friend Hunter, he's a homeless guy, and before the interview, he said, hey, do you still need some snow pants? And I said, yeah. He said, all right, I got a pair you can have. Only deal is you got to make a review on them. So that's what we're doing today. These are men's large Columbia Convert snow pants made by Columbia. It says made in Portland, Oregon, and then it says made in China. So I don't know, but these are pretty cool and they were free. I've looked at them on Amazon and eBay. I couldn't find the exact exact model same one as these ones but they run anywhere from 30 to 60 dollars and that's used so when hunter finds that out he might want these back <laughs> but pretty good deal so you know you got your logo here convert they have a uh double button fly and velcro and then a, or i mean a zipper fly and then buttons at the waist and velcro they are 100% nylon shell, waterproof shell, and 100% nylon uh, lining inside. They also have boot gaiters, which are pretty cool. So these things, you can uh, use the buttons here and the Velcro. You can tighten it up around your boot at your ankles and the pants hang down. These are a little too big for me, so they drag on the ground. And, uh, you know, they're used, so they got a little wear at the bottom here. But it's not bad. Inside, we have uh, polyester, 100% polyester uh, brushed lining, which I believe is this part right here, and also this part. This is the insulation. This is polyester. Keeps your butt nice and warm. And we've got elastic. A little elastic on the waistband. Belt loops. Uh, these hooks, I believe, are for gloves or goggles if you're snowboarding. I think these pants are, are for snowboarding. They're an outer shell. They're not super insulated. They don't keep you super warm, but they keep you dry. They're waterproof, so that's good. No back pockets. Not a big deal, except I usually keep my wallet in my back pocket, but, you know, I'd be wearing pants underneath these, too. have my wallet in there, but they do have uh, two side Velcro pockets one here a little pull tab pretty cool and we've got a stitched logo there's another side pocket over here of course but one cool thing is down here at the bottom I thought this was for ventilation because some snow pants have zippers you can zip up to if it gets hot it lets the air in but this isn't this ventilation this is actually a little stash pocket down by the ankle so see the pants we got a little pocket down here you know anything secret you got to put in there it's not as noticeable but yeah so I'm gonna put these on and I'm gonna test them out I was thinking uh, 
how should I test these things out? How should I test out their waterproof? I thought maybe I'll just bury my legs in snow and see how long it takes me to get hypothermia, but that might not be a good idea. So instead what we're gonna do, I, I shoveled snow wearing these for about an hour this morning. I got some more snow to shovel later today. There's a lot of snow. And then tomorrow, or maybe later today sometime, I'm gonna go sledding with these. Where's my sled at? I don't know where my sled went. I got a sled somewhere. Tomorrow, I'm gonna take these things sledding. I'll bring the camera, I'll bring the phone with me and record it. And uh, see if we can't get, see how, how good the waterproofing on these really is. But, but yeah, that's, uh, that's pretty much the review of them. And once I test them, I'll let you know what I think of them once I really test them. And I just wanted to thank Hunter for giving me these. And, you know, glad I could make this little video for you. And if you want them back after I'm done, after you see the video, that's fine. You can have them back. <laughs> but that's it. Let's test these things out. Check it out. We're at the snow spot. Look at these hills. See all those kids up there? But that's like the bunny slope. We're gonna go over that way. It looks smaller, but that one's actually much steeper. That whole thing over there is a, a big long hill that a lot of people sled down. But we're gonna go over to the, uh, the harder side over here. See how there's like not really anybody there. That's because it's crazy steep. That's where I cracked my rib at last time. So we're gonna try to not do that this time. It is snowing. Let's give it a go. They are on the snowboards. What happened to, uh, <laughs> They're gonna do some crazier stuff than me. Dude just skied down this hill and hit that wall and hit that rail. It's crazy. Snow pants worked good even though I got buried in them. Still dry. I'm gonna try to do this first person view while I hold the phone, but I don't know how I'm gonna hold the phone and hang on to this at the same time. Here we go. Yeah, I can't do this one handed. Do the feet hang off. We're gonna try it though. <laughs> One handed.
phone's covered in snow. I'm covered in snow. My pants are dry though. Dry pants. I'm tired and I'm cold. Thanks for watching JS Urban Adventures, guys. Click on the videos over here on the side. Like, subscribe, share, comment, hit the bell, all that good stuff. I'm out. Columbia Convert snow pants work great.